Okay, I couldn't sleep, so I'm making some hot chocolate from these cacao pucks. Hold them in my hand so you can see the size of them. Made with organic cacao, which is another one of those things that is very um, indigenous to the area. And then um, they're hardened and sugar added. This is original cacao. And then to that, I'm going to add a quart of milk. So I'm using the instant pot here. And I usually just stir it until the cacao melts into the milk. They'll break down. And we're in Mexico. So when in Mexico, do as Mexicans do. That's the number one milk in Mexico. And I get the light version, so. Yeah, the pot is a little hot. So it's gonna. Heat that milk. And as you can see with the measurement on the side of that pot, it's about, you know, this turns into about four, four good cups. So to one quart, two pups, and then I just use this and stir it until the chocolate breaks down. So I'm going to do that and pause and then show you what it looks like. This is really good because it lowers blood pressure naturally. It's a um, very relaxing, you know, for going to sleep or for winding down. And it's also good for lowering stress. Um, mood enhancer. So I'll just pause the video and let you see what the chocolate looks like once these have started breaking down and the chocolate, uh, the milk becomes totally chocolate from these organic pucks. Another one of those products that I try to buy instead of buying the quick Hershey's version. I even had the Ebolita kind um, which is okay but it's not as organic. It's just more mass produced. Let me see if I can find one of those, the Ebolita in my refrigerator. I might still have one of those that I bought or got from a friend. Let's see. I used these and they were okay. Matter of fact, a friend gave it to me. But like I said, it's 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 Mexico brand. But if Nestle says it all, that's that's really Nestle. So that's a chocolate puck, but it's not organic, and it's just Nestle chocolate, basically with probably some solids in it. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, it probably has that corn syrup or something like that. Now, it'll make chocolate, and it'll be sweet and sugary, but it's not cacao. This, These are cacao. Oh, and they're already breaking up, so as you can see, I'm mashing them down. See? They break up once they the milk starts uh, breaking them down. Boy, that, you can just smell that cacao, and I usually sprinkle the top of my cup with some sugar. So I'm going to let that continue to break down. Okay, and now you can see, boy, look at that. It's all frothy, thickened up a little bit. Before I pause the video, I said I sprinkle sugar. No way. I sprinkle on top of my cup a little bit of canela, which is, of course, cinnamon. So I'm going to go ahead and pour some of this in a cup. And then what I do is pour the rest of it in this container over here, my um, French press, to let it cool before I put the rest of it back in the milk container. Because I only drink about a cup. So the other three cups, um, I'll have some tomorrow, maybe the next night. Every now and then I drink two cups. But usually one cup and then I'm sleepy, ready to go to sleep. And it's so relaxing and so good. 
All right, that's good. So let me unplug, pour it in the cup. And boy, you talk about good. Get one of my cups here. Okay, let's get this little thing so that I won't burn myself. I'll just pour it right in the cup. Boy, that's good. Pure chocolate. You can see those cacao nibs have broken down. Put a little cinnamon. And boy, that smells good. And then stir it. And I'm going to say goodnight. Night-night.